What's happening, everybody? Jay Shockblast here, and check it out. We have from Star Wars the Clone Wars character pack for Lego Star Wars The Force Awakens, Captain Rex. Now, Captain Rex is quite possibly uh, number one or number two most popular character to be created uh, from the Clone Wars, right there with Ahsoka Tano. Um, and both, it's you know not surprising considering both of them were a focal point of the series as um, part of Anakin's story. Uh, so Captain Rex was the leader of the 501st, uh, which uh, is Anakin Skywalker's clone army. Uh, it also became known as Vader's Fist, and um, that is you know Darth Vader's army now, even today. I, mean, I guess they all are Darth Vader's army, but I digress. Uh, so Captain Rex was created for the show, and I always remember when they announced the show, one of the first characters they showed off was Captain Rex, and it was explained that this was going to be uh, a fan favorite. This is a character that was going to, um, you know, show up a lot in the show. And I remember the night that the action figures were released. They had a big event, and I didn't know anything about Captain Rex at the time. Um, and I just wasn't quite sure if I should go ahead and uh, and pick up his figure. But uh, sure enough, he ended up becoming a fan favorite and a favorite of mine. Um, you know, I really love this, the, the Clone Wars series, you know, I love what they did with the Clone Wars, I love what they did with Rebels, I really love that Rex has shown up in Rebels, uh, because we're always kind of unsure what happened to Rex, you know, we, we see Commander Cody, another character who, you know, in the, in the grand scheme of things, was just an average, ordinary clone commander, uh, in, uh, episode three, but we see that relationship built uh, with um, Obi-Wan Kenobi over the course of the show so that his ultimate betrayal as part of Order 66, um, you know, it means something more. But uh, with, with Captain Rex, we never got to see that because, uh, you know, it, it's, we just didn't know. Um, he, didn't, he wasn't part of the movies, so we didn't know if he did take part in 66. Um, we don't know what happened when that order went down. We do know he made it through, though, uh, because he has shown up as an old-timer on, on Heroes. Um, so, uh, what does he do? He has... Uh, he can command troopers, which is a really big one. Uh, Leia is one of the few characters that could do that. He can blow up silver uh, objects, and he can grapple. I always like my... Uh, Cool guys don't look at explosions. <laughs> oh man, uh, that's just my favorite thing to do in this game. To be honest with you, is to uh, throw a little thermal detonator, and then uh, let the just kind of turn around. And I always try to make screenshots that way. But um, he also he can rapid fire, which is kind of cool. Um, I would venture to say that Rex is probably one of my favorite clones. Um, I like the shock troopers, so the shock troopers are generally my favorite, but uh, Rex is right up there with them. I mean, if they're looking for so more, I'm definitely glad that they were uh, that they added uh, Rex as part of the DLC. I mean, it makes total sense that they would do it, considering oh, I can't believe I can't find anything to blow up. <laughs> um, it makes sense that they would pick him, just considering uh, that he is so popular. Um, Oh, are you serious? Why would not walk onto that before? Sad face. So, uh, how stoked are you guys to have Captain Rex in the game? Um, you know, I think they did a really good job with him. Obviously, this isn't his first uh, rodeo when it comes to uh, Lego Star Wars games. He was in uh, the clone Lego Star Wars 3, the Clone Wars, so... There is that. Why can I not find anything to blow up? <clears throat> I think it, uh, yeah, I just didn't reach out. Oh, this, this should be it. There we go. No! No! <laughs> it blew up too fast. Anyway, uh, there is Captain Rex. I hope you guys enjoy the video. <laughs> and checking out them guns. We'll see you.